What's up guys, it's Instinct here, and today I'll be showing you guys how to improve the quality of your renders. These are a few steps that I've been doing lately in my designs, and I have noticed that they actually have a big impact on how your design will look. Alright, so, first thing you want to do is uh, open your render up. Now I have this black uh, layer here, just so you guys can kind of see what's going on here. So, first thing you want to do is select your layer, go to Filter, and go to sharpen and click sharpen. Now what you guys can do is if I hit control Z you guys will notice how this is kind of blurred and it just basically makes it higher quality it sharpens everything up to make it more visible. Now once you have this done go ahead and hit control J. Um, take the bottom layer go to filter go to blur go to Gaussian blur and scale this up to like 50 pixels, 50 to 60 pixels, and this will add a glow. So the, the bigger the uh, pixels, the, the higher the glow. I'm gonna put this about like 50. Okay. So what you guys wanna do is select the middle layer, go to filter, go to distort, and go to ripple. Go ahead and change the percent to like 300 to 400%. Go ahead and click medium or large and go ahead and click OK and you'll see it adds this displacement kind of effect this like ripple here and if you go to the top layer you can uh, lower the opacity and it will start to be see-through so usually I put this at like 80% or so and you can kind of see that it's see-through a little bit so it's already looking really good so one more thing that I do is I hit Control J duplicate the one that's at 80% and then go ahead and click this button here and just drag a bunch of rectangles like this hold sh control and shift and then just slide it to the left or the right and just keep doing this as many times as you want this will add like a little glitch effect and yeah just keep doing this as many times as you want I'm just gonna stop right there as you can see there's like a little glitch effect Alright, so basically, before you actually merge these, uh, don't merge the uh, this one, don't merge the blur one, uh, right click, uh, merge layers, don't merge this one just yet, okay, so hit control J on this one, like again the one without the blur, control J, go to filter, and to go to filter gallery, go ahead and click glowing edges and click OK. Now change this to overlay and lower the opacity to about 20%. And this will just add like a, like a, uh, it'll basically darken it a little bit and add like a little glow to it. So, alright, now you can merge these layers, uh, merge all these layers. Alright, so now what I was going to show you before. So once you have your main layer, you go ahead and make a new layer and to darken it, all you have to do is go to the black here, click this little brush, and make sure it is on 0% hardness, and make the size to about like the render here, and just go over like the right parts. I'm rushing this, um, just so the tutorial is quick. Um, kind of like that, you know, just go over like the right parts. Again, I'm rushing this, so it's gonna be bad. Go to overlay and then change this to like 20% or something as you can see this darkens it even more maybe get to like 30% yeah and then go ahead and make another layer switch over to the white and you can basically do this again except for like darker parts so for example like this little spine here uh, make the brush about the size of the spline and you guys can kind of just go over this little spline here Get like these little ridges here Again, I'm rushing over this so Kind of like that maybe Like that Go to overlay again, and as you can see it makes it brighter Load the opacity to like whatever you want so let's say 25 or something and it brightens it. Now I'm actually gonna get this bottom part here. But yeah, so this is pretty much it. This is all I really do to 
prepare my renders in Cinema 4D. So I hope you guys found this tutorial helpful. If you guys did, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Peace. I have done my love.